for several YouTube channels. When she creates feature-length film content, her channel has been able to gather a huge audience of film lovers across the globe. Thank you so much. She said, thank you so much. So like I said, I put a little... Um, if they tell me our roots, as they have pronounced her hair, as, 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 yeah, I sold her. First of all, personally, I don't know anything about her. Hair stumbled on me, and I started the business. But it's not about how you start. It's about how you handle the process of the business. Because when I went into hair business, I like to know so much about any business that I'm doing. Ask her now. So she told you, I went into like, oh, I don't go meet. I go meet one maker. Anybody come and tell me. So, but then I also understand that there's something called trade secrets, which I respect. A lot of women are very sensitive and salty. If you ask a person, say, I beg, what can I be going They sell hair. You come with that home, I won't sell hair. Oh, great idea. That's a good idea. The person will now sit you down, advise you. After she has finished advising, you can say, hey, I beg, where do they buy a sister? What's going on with you? I should take it where I'm buying my hair. There's something called trade secrets. You all have to respect that. It's not a place where you start fighting. Hey, I come with that. She don't answer me. Really? If she gives you everything, what will she keep for herself? It's okay. If you see any business person who even gives you five minutes of their time, you are not paying for consultation, you are not paying for anything, they give, I appreciate it. I came for root colors. Me, I just wanted to be selling color hair. One can advise me, color hair, you don't make money. You're not just going to be selling black hair, you know? I didn't ask one where are you buying your hair from? For me, that advice, I took it. And I made money, I made sales. And I learned how to start coloring hair. I just, I, I know hair now, eh? Don't even play. Do you understand? So I feel like a lot of us women, is whenever I see a couple women gathered, I get really scared. That's why I know that Pride is a very strong person. Because we are very sensitive about everything, even the ones we're not supposed to be sensitive about. I greet them, she won't answer me, problem. She asked me how much she will buy problem. She's my head. The fight in the business. We men. Hmm. I just lift myself. Je, 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 je. Before they will finish me with cause and swear. That's how the hair came. She wants to buy bone straight too. I gave her bone straight. She said the hair is not as bone as friends bone. I know you are always very sweet because they don't want to they call your name. Yeah. Oh, you, you understand? Yes, so I was having panic attack. You see, the hair is not. I now told her, I said, Mama, please, two years later, you come back and have this question. Who is going to have the question between two years? I'm taking up that hair and track your social media. Ah, I couldn't keep my And they always shock. When they start shouting, I start analyzing cost of return. Cost of. <laughs> I feel on top of the money. You know how this is going to be? God. Two weeks later, I need hear from her again. Two weeks later, she comes, sends me another picture. I want this hair. I said, Mama, you're not doing that. Where is Kenne? Kenne will say, uh -huh. Kenne will Kenne is my rep. Kenne will say that she will scroll up. She will say, uh -huh. Two weeks ago, you cost me. Yes. You, the, the only reason Kenne will now say, and see, the only reason I do not block her is that you say we should stop blocking. But well, this person cost me, and my father has died. And he cost, she cost my father. And she's telling me she wants another hair. That she cannot, that inside her, her conscience, that what she's told about her father, she cannot sell to, to that woman. And so I give her to another red. But I will now ask, come back. She says she does not know why she came back. Two weeks after, this is this real life situation. Yes, business. After insulting, maybe she has gone and realized that the hair was not bad. Then she should not, instead of her to come and apologize, so you know, as women, we expect certain treatment. We, we, we forget that they are our customers and they are not our friends. So I know we are all business minded people. So when they come without madness, we should all learn to forgive, especially the ones who live abroad. 
nos customers. They don't play. They quickly send money. I want to buy this food, they pay. But this, as fast as they are paying, that's the level they need to drag you. Because they live in a civilized world, and over there, if there's any really small thing, the return on investment, return policy, we don't have return policy here. But what's the problem with the air? There is no band. Okay, can you look for? Why should I look for bands? Who, who saw what I posted when I was in the US? <laughs> who saw that the places are called police for me? Ah, it's not for band, though. Ah. The, the hair later came out. Who saw the video? If you saw it, raise your hand. I later saw, this is since last year, oh, she said that they must tell her the day I am entering the US. I was supposed to go, go in, November, in October, I didn't go. She carried police, she went there again. The videos are on my phone, I will show you. The videos are here, I later, I just don't want to post it. I now wish America. She said that I, I, I just got to America, I did not call her. You have my number, I told them to. This is a real life situation though. I have my number. She, I gave her my own now personal number, no more red. Once you see me in America, call me, let's see the end. She saw, um, she went to the police again. She got there, she was there shouting and calling 911. The, the girl now called me. She now, this long and short is that they later brought out the hair. It was that the band caught and she doesn't know how to fit it. We now arrange fitting for her to come for fitting. The video is here, I've not yet finished that story on Instagram. The day she came for fitting, do you know what she was carrying? Her hair is natural because the issue was that the wig did not enter her head. The day she came for with fitting, she was carrying all retouched hair that she packed at the back. I'm not this here on my phone. Maybe I will open it and pass it around. She was carrying all retouched hair. Tell me how on earth, when it is not fringe, how on earth anybody that knows what she has called police and then me now give you people an important gist. I swear, I tell you, we are not supposed to swear. I was at the back of the car, even when, because we settled, of course, they were driving me home. I was seeing her chat, like, you know, when somebody's DM pops up, the chat, the second, after the first person, the first one was a hair vendor, she was chatting. The second one was just lover. I'm telling you, that means she was already compiling those things and submitting it to just lover. I saw with my if I don't have to swear, but I'm telling you. I'm not posting so my the only part I did not video is that I didn't I didn't see it coming. That time her phone came up and I saw her DM. Do you understand? I didn't video that part. She was chatting this lover and getting this lover. Of course, what because Jesus Christ. And the issue was that number one, band cuts, and number two. Your hair is not flat enough for hair to enter your head. So I don't know maybe why this love that did not carry it is that maybe even this love that saw, saw that the woman is stupid. <laughs> you understand? But there are many of them that will come out on the street and you will know how to defend yourself. So, <laughs> so when you know that a lot of your customers are abroad, personally you should just strive for perfection and know that sometimes maybe some of them are dealing with personal issues and you are the closest person for them to lash out at. Hello guys, are we, are we together? Yeah. So, uh, priceless, I think me and you have a question. Is there any other thing I, I haven't touched? Business, social media is one of the strongest tools for any business right now. I heard you guys talking about using influencers and stuff like that. Um, out of experience, I also know that it's not about the number of followers that the influencer has. It's something called oil. I've been a businesswoman, so I know these things. There are people that will advertise your business, you will not say one cup of some that they will even be begging you use this person and I say no she doesn't have followers no but that person you get them they here like this so uh how do you know these people I don't know how because truthfully you can't 
follow everybody. A lot of people want the big, the, the big ones, and the, you know. But when you follow, this, this, this I see a reactor. I see. I don't know. I'm not doing business, but there's something about that girl. If she's doing her waist training, I want to. If she's doing cream, I want to. She's even the one that made me know Jenny's game. Do you understand? There are people that when they, when they carry a product, they go hungry you. And there are people, I need to do that too. She has that. Shalom! 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 But it's sure for me. It's sure for me. So, know them. Find them. I don't do a fancy for people anymore because I know whatever I touch turns to gold. She wore one of my brain wigs. You know I don't like calling figures. We say low profile. She wore one of my brain wigs that time. She bought it though. She bought, thank you Ruth. Thank you so much. She bought it, wore and tagged me. I, I don't want to declare how much. That, those were the days I used to ship brain wigs in boxes. I mean in boxes, not now that we are using package. Thank you so much for that. So there are so many of them out there. It's not about the followers. It's not. It's as a business person, you need to also find it so that at the end of the day, you're not because and especially when you want to do business with an influencer, if the person starts stressing you, no matter the amount of money you think that person is going to bring, that should be a red flag for you. For you, because truthfully, one post cannot do the job. You need like a you synchronize with the brand. If somebody sees 